ever winter online. Uh, it's a really, really pretty amazing game. But they have an event this month called uh, Days of the Dungeon Master. And uh, when you go to the event coordinator, uh, you actually enter a world and you look around and you are a miniature in a board game. You even have a little stand at your feet. You move around on the stand, there's NPCs that come up and they have stands. And then you look above you and there's all the characters looking down uh, at you uh, who are heroes from the D&D books. It's pretty freaking amazing. So I'm going to take some film. I had fraps, but I freaking deleted it. So I'm just going to go with a cell phone. Uh, my speakers, I bought brand new speakers, but the front two speakers aren't working and all I get is bass. So um, I'm going to try this with bass in the background see what happens. And um, here's Days of the Dungeon Master. As you can see here, I'm uh, in front of the uh, Dungeon Master and the board to his left is uh, actually a board game. And it's a world that uh, you step into and become a miniature. Uh, or you can interact with all the NPCs there. And uh, there's uh, two adventures that uh, include five other players. And so we all become miniatures and uh, the Dungeon Master explains what we see. And of course you'll see it visually in real time. So it'll be really kind of an interesting run. And we're gonna start uh, right now. As you can see, uh, I'm here with uh, other characters as well. Uh, my Earth Elemental is uh, right to my right, I believe. And we'll uh, try to move toward the guy. And you can see people around the board, which is kind of amazing. And, uh, and, uh, it's actually the most interesting uh, MMO mini game I've ever uh, taken part of. And we'll talk to this guy. It looks like here comes my party. And playing one hand is a little tough, so I'm going to have to turn around here. Here's some of the characters in AD&D in the past. Heroes of the books. And you probably recognize this uh, character if you've uh, read the D&D books. This is Minsk. Um, he has a trusty hamster named Boo. He's uh, one of the original... Uh, books I'm not quite uh, remembering which series that was uh, probably somebody will let me know but uh, uh, Minsk was a berserker and he had a ham pet hamster uh, named Boo um, pretty interesting character and you will meet him in uh, Neverwinter Nights uh, this is Dritz and uh, of the drow and uh, he is also a meetable character NPC in the game. So it's amazing what uh, the depth and the detail of this game is, and I really enjoy it. Uh, it's called Neverwinter Nights Online, or Neverwinter Online. It's also out for, for the PS4 and I believe Xbox. So uh, if you get a chance to play it, uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, I have a 70 Paladin, 70 Cleric, 70 Wizard. This was actually a straggler left over, so. I'm actually uh, fighting a NPC character. This is a boss fight, as you can see. And we just defeated that. Well, these are actual player characters in the game. You can see player character uh, 
trying his hand at a carnival game in the background. The uh, you can paint your characters. Uh, there's dyes, and uh, uh, my character is fully painted. Uh, so is this character to my right. Looks to be a wizard, if I'm correct. Um, but it's an amazing game. There's a lot to it, and. Uh, as you can see, uh, Basalt is my Earth Elemental, and I am a 70-level Paladin. And we're back into the uh, real world of Neverwinter. I uh, hope you enjoyed the tour. hope you enjoyed a little bit of a glimpse of the uh, event, Day of the Dungeon Master. Thanks again for watching.